Carilion Clinic spine surgeon Dr. Jonathan Carmouche is part of a research collaboration between Carilion's Department of Orthopedic Surgery, Virginia Tech Carilion School of Medicine, and Virginia Tech's Biomedical Engineering Department. We've partnered with the medical school specifically uh, to have those students who are interested in going into orthopedics spend time with us. Just part of his role as a Virginia Tech Carilion School of Medicine assistant professor of orthopedic surgery. In this lab at Virginia Tech, students are compression testing pieces of synthetic bone. The goal is to determine how much pressure can be applied before it breaks. One of the questions that we had was if we take bone from one of the bones in your neck, will that actually make your neck weaker? And so the best way to test that is to use sort of engineering materials. Think of these pieces as vertebrae in the spine. Students are removing different size samples from different areas, ultimately to determine what, if any, weakening is caused using this technique. The point of our project is to make sure that these bone harvests from the vertebrae themselves do not damage the structural integrity of the bone. The fact that we're taking bone from your own body and putting it back in is going to help in fusion um, and make sure that those bones do fuse together and that you do get a good result. Um, from your surgery. But the big thing being there's only been one surgical incision and so less chance of infection at the second surgical site. A computer records the data from dozens of tests. We started and developed a, a group which we call the Musculoskeletal Education and Research Center. Uh, the, the purpose of that group is to allow busy clinicians like ourselves, to also be academically productive, meaning to do research projects. Just one example of how rewarding this project has been for students includes Connor and Zach presenting their collaborative work on behalf of everyone involved at the American Academy of Orthopedic Surgeons International Meeting in Orlando, Florida. I've debated between pursuing a career in medicine and pursuing a career in engineering, and so when this project came forward, um, which was really a combination of both, it was really exciting for me that I was going to get to see how engineering can actually contribute to the advancement of medicine and that they don't have to be mutually exclusive from each other. Okay. Collaboration leading to improvements in patient care. Karen McNew for Carilion Clinic.